Hey guys, I'm Trent. I'm Michael. In this video, we're going to show you how to use multiverse on your Minehut server. Okay, so this is a little bit more advanced video where we're going to go through how to use a specific plugin. So before this, if you haven't watched it yet, make sure you know how to install plugins, you know how to OP yourself, and you know how to use the file manager. And we have all videos for those. Just head back over to the videos tab and find those earlier videos and get caught up. Nice. Okay, so we're going to start by installing a couple of plugins. So we're going to head on over to our panel. I'm on the main page right now, and I'm, of course, going to go over to the plugins tab on the left side. Yep, and this is minehut.com. Once your server is activated, you'll find it no problem. And I'm going to search up for multiverse, and there's a couple of multiverse plugins, but we're just going to use the main one today. Mm -hmm. So we're going to click the drop down and then install plugin. Cool. That one's now installed. And now you can see that it's installed because there's a green check mark on the right side. And then we're also going to search for void generator because we want to make a void world and we are going to install that one right now as well. Cool. Install plugin. What's a void world? It's a world where there are no blocks. So that way, like if you want to do a sky block or just like a build from nothing. Ah, uh, gotcha. Cool. Yes. So now if we go over to install and we get rid of that search, we will see that we have these two plugins coming up. We're going to go over back to the home tab and uh, get the plugins installed. We have to restart our server as we know standard, from previous videos. Yep, standard yep. Minehut operating procedure. Exactly, exactly. So we're going to wait for our server to restart. We'll click the stop button. It is offline. And start it one more time. Boop, boop, boop to the left. Boop, boop, take it back now, y'all. One hop this time. Bam. Two hops this time. Bam, bam. <laughs> hey, that's the sound. We're online. Ding, 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 ding. That's us. Okay, we're gonna go back in game now. And now we're in game. Okay, so we're gonna take a look and we're gonna do slash PL and we see that these plugins are installed. So cool. void generator and multiverse core. So the first thing that I wanna do is just create a new world and I'm just gonna call that, that, that my world. So mm -hmm. I'm gonna do slash MV, so that's multiverse. Wow. Create, and then we're gonna call the world name Trent. And then we want the world type to be normal, just, just like a regular world. But we want to add a different world type. So we're going to do a dash T. Dash T for type. Yep. And then we're going to do flat. And we want, Sick. we're going to make a new flat world called Trent. Cool. Starting creation of world Trent. And you, and you can do this all from within your server, which is really cool. Yep. This, I'm an OP on the server. I'm going in and I'm typing these commands. There we go. And then I'm going to type slash MV list. And that's going to show me the worlds and what type they are. Very cool. And then I can type slash MV TP and then the world name, and it will teleport me to that new world. So multiverse teleport. Yes. Ah, flat world. And I see a slime. Uh, flat world's always, you, you always see a lot of slimes. How oh, I've missed you, flat world. Yep, so there's, wow. I've returned to the scene of my cow punching crimes. Wow, that's crazy. Ha <laughs> I remember we, In, yeah. Inside Minehub 101 <laughs> jokes. <laughs> Hilarious. Uh, okay, so now we see that there are just a lot of like endies and things like that that we want to get rid of. So I am going to modify the properties of this world to get rid of those guys cool. so i am going to do such mbm so like multiverse modify and then set and then i'm going to do animals animals false and this is just going to make it so there are no animals in the world nice wow and then there's going to be another one as well because those are animals but there are also monsters in this world so oh. i'm going to do such mbm yep set. set and then just monsters this time okay and, and then false. i'm going to do false and then there they go and now, and now this world will not have any animals or monsters spawning at all. I, I can like, we can record a video in nice peace and quiet without the slimes interrupting us. Finally. Wow. Okay. So now the next thing we want to do is it's, you know, it's cool that we've got this world, but we want to make an end world, right? Mm -hmm. And since that I already, cool. I already had mine and now you can, you, we can name this world after you. Oh. So if we're making an end world named after you, what's a, what's a good name for that world? Um, Deef End. Wow. Nice, nice. Okay, okay. So we're gonna do such MB create because we okay. want to create another world, and then we're just gonna go deep end uh -huh. like as as the world name, yeah. and then as the world type. So before we were doing normal, now we're gonna type end. Cool. And we're gonna we're gonna do that. Oh my. Okay, that was that was quick. All right, let's go off the deep end. Let's go deep end. Oh, you can't spell my name. No, I. There we go. <gasps> oh my gosh. Oh, it's creepy. Okay, there's there's the portal. There's don't look those at guys. Them. Oh yeah, and then there's a dragon up there. Ah! <laughs> Got him. And then remember, if we wanted to do an end without any monsters, mm -hmm. MEM set monsters false. And then all the Endermen are gone. The it, yeah, it, it looks like dragons are just OP. Yeah, yeah they won't Or maybe away. maybe it's like set dragon false. So we can look MVM set dragon false. No. No. Yeah. <laughs> we can look up okay. the for yeah, that. Well, yeah, I know. <laughs> Uh, cool. Okay, so now this is a very loud world to be recording, and so we're gonna hop back into just MVTP world. 
Yeah, bring us oh. back into this main world here, nice and beautiful. Mm. Right. Uh, so this yeah. is our this is our our normal. What yeah, yeah, yeah. This is our normal world. And now, so now here's the problem. If we type slash mv list, we can see that we have defend world, mm -hmm. world the end, world nether and trends. Mm -hmm. So and we, those are the other ones, the nether and the end. Those are the ones that naturally come with your server. It, exactly. Right? All the ones that are world underscore something are just like the default worlds mm -hmm. that it makes when you start your server for the first time. So question then, if I were to build a nether portal, yes. that'll probably take me to the normal exactly nether, right. Yes. Yeah, so there's another multiverse plugin that we'll get into later that allows you to actually hook up overworlds with end worlds and nether worlds. Well, Oh, cool. um, but we're not going to get into that for this video. So for now, what we want to do is so that we, we, if we ever playing on this server and we go to the end, it will bring us to the regular end. Mm -hmm. So we're just going to delete the deep end. Uh, so yeah. So to delete a world, all we was, have to it do. Was, it was good while it lasted. Yeah. yeah. We're going to do such MV delete all one word there and then defend because we just want to get rid of that. It'll ask me to confirm because it's like you're, you're deleting your yeah, world. It's a big commitment. Yep. And then we're going to type it and then that's it. And then if we do MV list again, it is no longer there. And we just deleted the deep end. Yes. Okay. The next thing that we're gonna show you guys is how to create a void world with multiverse here. So I have, of course, installed the void generator plugin and this is required for this. So void generator and multiverse. Now what I'm gonna do is another MV create. Mm -hmm. And then this time what we're gonna do is call it void. void. And then, yep. And then we wanna make it sure a- Sure we don't wanna make a world for Molly? A Molly, Molly's world? Yeah. No, okay, you're right, you're right, you're right, you're right. So, MV create Molly. Okay. Is, is that like a joke? We're creating a void world for her or something? I don't know. This is where this is where she conducts all of her support. Okay, yeah, we're just we're just we're, we're supporting. And then it's gonna be a normal world. That just means it's like a, a regular world, not an end or a nether. Mm -hmm. And then we're gonna type dash G for using a generator. Oh. And then very important, we're gonna type void generator. Just like that. Mm -hmm. And then this will create us a new void world, and it should be quick because it's like not doesn't have to generate much. There we go. And we're gonna do MVTP Molly, Molly, and this should bring us to a void world. So I'm gonna, I, I wanna be careful because I don't wanna fall through the void here. Mm -hmm. So I'm gonna, I'm gonna TP and then, okay, yeah. Oh. I'm on like a single piece of bedrock and then this is just a void world, Whoa. just like that. And then, so if you wanna do Skyblock or if you just wanted to start in like an empty world and build out from there, that's all you gotta do. Very cool. Okay, we are gonna now go back to the overworld. Mm -hmm. MVTP world. Oh, it's night now. Yeah, I'm gonna, I, 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 like, the, I like the daytime. Okay, so the spawn was over here, and that's a pretty cool spawn, but I just, I wanna bring people over over here. Oh, so you can set spawns yeah, with these. Yeah, away, away from that skeleton. Yeah. Yes, we're, we're gonna, yeah, this is a better spawn island. Okay. Yeah, spawn island. So, Multiverse also allows you to set the spawn of your world, and so this is when players first enter your server, the point that they will spawn, or if they type slash spawn, if you have a plugin set up that will allow them to do that, it'll bring them here. It's always good to make a good first impression. Exactly. So what we're gonna do is just do slash MV set spawn, and then that will set us the spawn on the world. Now, when we're going between worlds as well, you'll see if we go MV uh, TP, world underscore d underscore end will bring us here real quick mm -hmm. and then we're going to tp back to the main world okay and it should bring us to that new spawn point. yes it did yep. just like that we're no longer over on skeleton island and that's how you set up multiverse on your mine hut server